Hi, this is Haley and Michael's The Price I Pay. It is April 3rd, <laughs> 2015, and we have some of this stuff charted out on your paper here. Um, the first part for the verse, I just realized, I mean, we can finger pick it. But at no point are two strings being played at the same time, so if you want to just use your pick. What's happening there, you always pick in the direction of the next string that you're playing. So I'm going down on C, up on that high C. Yeah, but that, that first pattern, we're going to do it four times. It's just a C chord. We're going from second string to the fifth string twice. And then we're going to take our pointer finger off and go open on the fifth string. So the whole thing together is. And then what we're going to do is take our pointer finger and drop it on the fourth string, second fret. And then pull that off and just go from two to four. The whole thing together at this point is. If we play it with our fingers, it'll sound like this. So that was twice on C. We do that four times the whole way through, and then we jump to an A minor, which would be same thing as we did on the C, only our ring finger is off. See, it's an A minor 7 if we don't have that ring finger. Same thing with our pointer finger, though. Do is jump to that F major 7 that you know. Well, it doesn't really have to be a major 7, we're not going to hit that high string anyway, but it's going to sound like this. So we're just playing the pointer finger, pulling it off, playing middle finger, pulling it off. So we got C, 2, 3, 4, A minor, F, A minor, F. The whole, the whole verse together is going to sound like this. I think they actually do the verse like twice before they jump into the chorus at the beginning. But your chords for this chorus are C for four. This weird, you, know, you, you could probably play a regular G, but I think in the key of C, a G that sounds good and aesthetically pleasing is this. Because we have that theme in all of our chords. So I'm going to play my G by just taking my ring finger bumping it down to that low G, using it to mute my A string and taking my middle finger off. So I only have two fingers down on my guitar and from beginning to end my strings are mute, open, open, point up, open. C. And then we're gonna hit this F where it's like basically our C but we're just going to stick our pinky right there. So it doesn't really matter what we do with our middle finger. If you're feeling gutsy, we can take our thumb and wrap it around and stick it on that low F. So the chorus so far is C, G. Do a D minor, which we can either play like a D minor seventh, it's the way I charted it for you, or you can play it like a regular D minor. Back to the F.
let's put it all together.